Gabe here from Gabe Games and welcome to another video but today we are not going to be doing a game we are going to be making a craft that's why you are not seeing any screens see you can't see any screens but um we will be doing a part two of this because I don't have a lot of time but I can show you a few other steps uh, so, the materials you'll need for a 14 teller, because that's what we're going to be making today. But, the materials you're going to need are, is a piece of paper, scissors, and a pen. Uh, you can use a pencil, and if you want to use crayons, you can, but I'm not going to use crayons. You can use the crayons. So, um... Let's get started. So, first what you're going to do is, you take your piece of paper right here. Okay, you have to look on the table. And then you take this corner. Wait, uh, I forget how to do this. Uh, oh, uh, you, you take this corner, uh, you flip it, or you can take the, half of this corner and flip it. Uh, it doesn't really have to be perfect, but when you're finished doing the crease, so, uh, See how it looks like this when when I haven't done the crease. Uh, to do the crease, uh, it doesn't have to be perfect because mine's not perfect. But it has to make a little tip. It doesn't really have to be a perfect tip. But uh, yeah, I didn't make it perfect on my first time. Uh, so what you're gonna have is this. And you see this little rectangle? You can use your pen for this, but uh, I'm not going to use it. Actually, yeah, I'm not going to use it, but you can. Uh, just draw a line right over here. Like, uh, like uh, from this corner to this corner. Well, it's the corner of this, uh, the top part. But like this side to this side, uh, where the rectangle is. Uh... But you don't have to do that. And then just cut off that rectangle. That's useless now. Uh, so I'll just cut it off. Oh yeah, I have made this. That's why uh, I'm really good at this already. Ow. Wow. Ugh. What you should have is this as scraps and this. Okay, now what you have to do is open it up, make it flat. Now, you will see a line down the middle. If you see that line, uh, you can do the next step. If you do not see that line, please do it again. But next step is take the uh take one of the corners from the line either the top or the bottom see either this one or this one so it kind of looks like a diamond right now but um what you're going to do is fold it so that each corner touches not so it looks like another triangle like the other crease so now you should either have an x or a plus now, what you want to do, wait, yeah, uh, now what you want, now what you want to do is, uh, crease each corner, so, each of these corners, so, one, two, three, four, into the middle, so, I will show you what it looks like when you are, because, uh, when you are finished with this step, I will be stopping the video uh, so I can save some more uh, because it might just stop on me because you know what cameras do if you made a YouTube video or you just made a video that you can't post but uh yeah so now let's crease each one then it should look like this. So 
some of them might pop out like that one. Let's give them a bigger crease. So try giving it a bigger crease so it stays down. Uh, sometimes it doesn't work, but it's okay. Uh, so I have to stop there, guys. I'm sorry. This is like one of the shortest videos ever. But you should have this right now. If you saw this video, I will be doing a part two. That will be in the description below because I am going to make it right away. So, uh, uh, I will, in the next video, I will be putting the, if you guys, uh, did not see it, this video, I will be putting this video in the description, in the description below on the next video, but you guys should really check out my other videos, uh, I hope you guys really like me, so, good, bye, peace out.